also have the consistency of tapioca pudding? Yes, the entire brain was decomposed, yes. And is that one of the reasons that, that did that hinder you in attempting to find out what a trajectory was? Yes, in addition to lack of hemorrhage in the wound to begin with. If the hemorrhage had still been there, I might have been able to identify that, even in a decomposed brain. Uh, but there was really no hemorrhage, and the brain was uniformly uh, green, gray, and soft. And if there is no hemorrhaging there, uh, that's what you previously indicated, could indicate that he was already dead. Yes. And if the bullet goes in this direction, and the frontal lobe is there, is it your opinion, even though the brain was in that tapioca pudding kind of state, that you can at least give us an indication as to what the trajectory was? And I know previously you indicated some, something about simple geometry. Yes, uh, if you draw a line straight from the right front part of the head uh, towards the left cheek, which is, which is in this area here. Go ahead, and, go ahead and draw the line if you can. I, I don't know exactly how to work it. But. Trajectory is this way, and the cheek is in this location. So the bullet ends up here. 